Hello, I'm Dr. Manny. I'm here to answer your questions. The human papillovirus, or HPV, is the most common sexually transmitted infection in the U.S. In fact, it's so common that nearly all sexually active men and women get it at some point in their lives. We got this question from a viewer. Dear Dr. Manny, my OBGYN recently told me I have HPV. I know it's extremely common and that your immune system can naturally clear the infection over time, but I'm still freaking out about it. Since I'm over the age limit for the vaccine, is there anything else I can do to help get rid of it? Thanks, Rachel. Well, Rachel, it's estimated that 50% of those infected with HPV will clear the virus within eight months and 90% will be cured within two years. It's only when your immune system isn't able to fight off the infection that some strains of HPV can persist and lead to cancer. That's why getting regular screenings and pap tests are so important for women. But testing positive for HPV does not automatically mean you will get cancer. It just means that you have a virus that needs to be cleared from your body. For more on how to eliminate the infection naturally, we checked in with an expert. First, avoid smoking. And if you smoke, quit smoking. Second, avoid oral contraceptives. Studies show that the birth control pill can increase your likelihood of HPV turning into cancer. And next, if you consider using an IUD instead of using the oral contraceptives, then you wanna consider using the copper IUD rather than the one that contains hormone because the hormone-containing IUD has been shown to possibly increase the risk of HPV turning into cancer and not getting cleared from your body. Finally, I would tank up on certain vitamins because several vitamins have been shown to increase the likelihood of clearing the HPV. The first one is B vitamins, especially folic acid and B12. You wanna make sure that you're getting enough of these vitamins to help clear the HPV from your system. And finally, vitamin E, but not just any old vitamin E. You want to especially make sure you're getting good levels of beta and gamma tocopherol. Thanks, Doc. Do you have a health question? Email them at drmanny at foxnews.com. Until next time, I'm Dr. Manny.